Welcome back, everybody. Are you ready, you guys? I think we're ready for a holiday weekend. It's a lot of vodka in front of me at 8.15 on a Friday morning. Uh, but, you know, we have some serious business to talk about, too. Historically, July 5th, as some of you may know, especially here in San Diego, it's been known as the dirtiest beach day of the year. People leave all this trash from the weekend, and then uh, so many people have to go out and clean it up. So our next guest here prefers to help keep our beaches clean and our martinis dirty. We have Humboldt Distillery McC Mixologist Megan is joining us. You're mixing up cocktails that protect and restore California's waterways. Uh, so, you know, so many good things coming out of this. We can all cheers to that, right, Megan? Right. Yeah. <laughs> all right, let's talk about this. What is your Toast to the Coast campaign? So the Toast to the Coast is um, an alliance that we have with California Coast Keepers um, to do beach cleanups and help them um, just keep California's waterways um, and oceans uh, clean for us to be um, drinkable, swimmable, um, just for us all to enjoy. And you know, Humboldt Distillery, I was looking at, obviously is in Humboldt. Uh, you're here in San Diego. So yeah. you know, we know all up and down the coast of California, July 5th gets kind of dirty. Like Monday morning we wake up and we yeah. see so much trash. Uh, tell us why this is important for you guys to address. Um, it's important for us because um, one of the main parts of our vodka is our water. Um, we have a really nice water source up in um, Humble. Um, we also, it's really important to us to partner with the, the California Coast Keepers. Um, a portion of all of our bottle sales go to the, the organization. Um, yeah, so we're just trying to do our part. I love that. I love that you obviously can appreciate water in the distillery business. Uh, and we want to keep it clean. You know, obviously, we all care about our planet and our waterways. And it's cer certainly important in San Diego. So I see you have uh, some bottles in front of you, too, Megan. Uh, what are you mixing up this morning? Um, so I'm going to make a really easy um, vodka lemonade. I'm going to throw some cucumbers in to keep it kind of interesting. Um, yeah, so it's a nice, refreshing um, summertime cocktail, perfect for Fourth of July. Yeah, I was gonna say it's gonna be nice and warm here in San Diego. Uh, so go ahead. How are you gonna put this one together for okay. people at home right now who are getting ready to come up with some ideas <laughs> this weekend? Um, so first, I'm gonna start with some fresh squeezed lemon. Just gonna do about three quarters of an ounce. Okay. I love the fresh squeezed lemon. A little extra pulp. Very oh, important. Good. Yes. <laughs> And then I'm going to do about three quarters of an ounce of simple syrup. Okay. I'm going to do two ounces of the humble organic vodka. All right. Two ounces, huh? Is that a shot or is that two shots? <laughs> <laughs> and then really easy, just throw um, some cucumber slices into the shaker. Okay. Uh-oh. I just froze, Ooh, but there gosh. we go. <laughs> Get your ice ready. Very nice. Shake, shake, shake. Very nice. I love that you guys sent in all of the parts. I just, I'm not going to make a vodka drink right now. I'll let you do that, Megan. <laughs> <laughs> Pour it over ice. Oh, I mean, poolside. It's going to be a nice, cool, refreshing drink for uh, 4th of July. I have some fun um, little American flags oh. to use for a garnish. Um, but if you're just home, just use a few cucumbers. Do a nice little um, slice at the side. Uh, yeah, that looks so good. Oh, cheers to you, <laughs> Megan. I don't know if you are willing to take a swig for us at 819, but I'm sure it tastes good. <laughs> why not? Like, why not? I will not, but I will I will toast to you. And we will toast to the coast. I think that is so great that you guys are a part of this campaign, doing something really important and spreading that important message. Yeah, yeah. It's definitely really important to us in the distillery. And um, obviously with Humboldt Distillery, if you guys could give us a little bit of uh, background here on your distillery. You said organic vodka, small batch, limited release. That's what it says on this bottle right here. Whoa, 40% alcohol. Okay, it's kind of strong, but that's what we're used to. Vodka has so that. Typical, it's a typical vodka with an 80, 80% okay. ABV. Oh, gotcha. That's normal. All right. But yeah, give us a little background about Humboldt. How did you guys start? Uh, you know, what's important to this distillery? Obviously, organic products are a key ingredient here. 
Um, well, prior to this position, I was a bar manager myself, um, and I had brought this into my bar. Um, I fell in love with the brands, and here I am. <laughs> That's Working awesome. for them now. Where can we get these uh, cocktails here in town if people want to go out this weekend? Um, you can get them at um, Metal Bar and Creamery um, in North Park. Um, we have we are behind the bar at Kindred in um, South Park. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, there's a lot of lo local liquor stores that also have us. Um, Harbor Market downtown. Very nice. All right, Megan, thank you very much. We appreciate it. And, of course, we want everyone to have a safe holiday weekend. No drinking and driving. If you enjoy that cocktail, obviously you're going to want to get a ride safely home. <laughs> Thanks, Megan. Thank you.